I almost completely forgot about this recording. Also, my body's in some kind of pain, but hopefully it's not serious. I'm about to find out, I guess, uh, in the coming days. But yeah, let's just get back into it. So um, yeah, let's left. Let's g continue where we left off. Although we are starting a new run. So seven, four, five, six, seven into uh, let's see. Three, so that's Yogata. As we get into Yogata Scars character exclusive, more custom characters. Um, still working on the things I'm doing on the side. Some of them related to World of Horror, some of them not, and some of them related to something completely different. But Takashi Sun Light, Second Mystery, Charisma, Strength, and Knowledge. I really should write down. Uh, cause there are things I wanted to talk about, and then I forget to do so. In this case, I guess I could talk about that. Um, don't I start with a thingy? I'm gonna, yeah, I start with a meat cleaver, which, three strength meat cleaver, it's workable. Um, need to upgrade soon though, because otherwise bad things will happen. Um, but yeah, what I could talk about are the... Oof. No, I'm forgetting! Why is my brain like this? Uh, it's, I, I wanna say it's because that, uh, I'm thinking of a lot of things, but... I mean, at this point, you, if you've been with my channel, you know, um, I'm not, I mean, it's all, all the evidence is on this channel, uh, from the hundreds of videos that I have. Uh, some of them not commentated, because my earliest videos are basically just as they are, uh, but that was more me, you know, practicing, being, again, being consistent, trying to put out at least a video daily, rather than try and commentate through gameplay, which was quite hard to do for me, uh, back in those times when I was playing Monster Hunter. They're Monster Hunter videos. Um, so, if we were past a minute, uh, hopefully that's safe enough to say. But, uh, man, lose knowledge. I mean, it's not the worst thing. It's just going to hurt. Um, I have Kana with me. Do I want to take a risk on this? Ugh, that's just as bad. But I, this, I'll just take the guaranteed three turn. But, um... Yeah, so the early videos are not anything much, and then I think I started off with the uh, the certain a certain HP game, I guess I'll say, kind of as I initial it. It's not actually two words, but you get what I mean if you've seen the things on this channel. And um, as we move into the topic of audience, uh, intended audience, preferably be of the, being of the legal age for this channel, because I may go over things that are um, not sensitive, but. Uh, not exactly the. I mean, I'm playing World of Horror right here. While it's not the most explicit game, it does have uh, very graphic displays of um, gore and stuff here and such. That doesn't include. Uh, as I move into the next topic, really quickly, because there's not really much else to say about the previous one. Um, I really should enter the police station. By the way, let me see here. Forest and hospital. Oh, writing things down. That's what I want to talk about. Anywho, let's do the forest. For I know I have coma, but I'm just gonna do forest anyway. Um. And then let's store this and move on. Yeah, well, while World of Horror has some graphic displays, I mean, I'm not going to... I don't think any developer deserves any, you know, backlash for... Or any uh, any criticism, if it ever does come, for basically modded content. Because the developers it has no control over that. And you could say the same of other very popular games that can be modded. Whether that's, you know... Uh, whether it has the developer support or not, I'm not just I'm not just talking about World of War, but any game really. Anyone who makes private modifications in their game, that's a whole thing. Of course, I'm not a lawyer. Uh, I don't have any experience in that department, aside from you know just trust me, bro. I looked it up online, things here and there. But in this particular instance. Um, when the developer, even, uh, you know, if the developer hands you ways to modify the game, you know, I don't know how that goes into court of law, but even, even then, like, it's not, the developer is not, um, well, one, the developer is not responsible for what the, a person does with their private copy of the game, and two, um... Uh, even whether you can't really control even if there are no mod there's no mod support for a game that doesn't stop someone from putting up footage of what they might you know their own uh, versions of a modified game basically so whether it's for their own fun or otherwise again if you know if something comes up that's you know not as great also does, do i die here for this I'm gonna close the door so I can run, because I think I die if I take that. I still die anyway if I continue taking this, unless I throw something like the bat, but... You know what? I might actually do that, because at least I get experience here. So I traded the baseball bat for that 8 experience, so... Why do I have 5? Okay, I, because of that. And I have Scars and Kana, so... Uh, let me actually just rest so I don't die immediately. I have fetid fumes, but there's nothing I can do about that. I might as well pop in the History Club as well. Um... Oof. 
maybe. And I'm gonna take Curse Doll instead, oddly enough. Um, and we'll move on. Hopefully, I don't die to reason. I'm stuck on. <laughs> no, you know what? Let's enter the pharmacy, looking for some uh, reason healing or not. Oh man. I hate anyone who says that the pharmacy is good now. <laughs> I mean, it's just me being a really oof, but... Uh, I might as well grab something while I'm here, right? And my luck, I don't care about my luck. So, um... Yeah, let's grab painkillers. Do something with our time. You know what? Let's, let's, visit the, well, let's visit the witch's tree instead and get a spell and uh, get nothing. But really, I took it so that I can heal reason. Watch me still die anyway. But to close off the topic, whether I die or not, um, in-game, um, ooh, let me, yeah, let me also investigate the mansion while I'm here, so that this force doesn't be as painful. Okay, let me finish the thought. So, um, yeah, I don't think the developer deserves blame. I mean, I personally wouldn't, but how would I, who, how would I know, right? Um, let's try to get a spell. Okay, never mind. <laughs> um, and move on. So, I mean, that's a whole that's a whole subject that I could talk about 10, 20, 30 minutes about uh, in terms of, you know, whether or not it's the developer's responsibility to manage what someone does with their own private copy. Now, if it's someone that's part of the of, of, of an official community, you know, whether that's Discord or some other site or some forum that's, again, officially supported by developer or allowed, um, I can't take the um, other one because that's reason damage. Um, I mean, again, th where that responsibility lies and the liability f of the developer, again, that's not my, uh, that's not my place to say. However, I will say that I would not, if I were on a jury, I would not judge against it. But it really depends on the situation. Obviously, if the developer has more of a sway in certain matters, um, or like, you know, actively support something that they shouldn't have, uh, whether it's, uh, well, particularly about their game or a mod about their game, then, yeah, I can't really defend you there because, well, you're just... If, if it's breaking a law, then, I mean, it, you're breaking the law. But, anywho. So what I wanted to talk about <laughs> before all of that was um, how, you know, writing things down for games, and I've talked about this before, but, you know, basically taking down notes. There, I think, for me, it's, there's a time and place for it that I personally hold myself to a standard to. If it's trying to remember the events of World of War, you know, that in that case, I might take notes outside of recordings, but while I'm in a recording, I'm not going to try to refer to notes. I'll try to remember things off the top of my head. What you do on your own copy of World of War, whether you have, like, a whole text file of, or spreadsheet of all the events and possible events, that's on you. Uh, but for me, um, I hold myself, only myself, when we're talking about myself, to a higher standard of trying to remember things. Also, this is, oof, I can guarantee one. Do I even want to do this, though? Minus one all? I might as well. Uh, I guess I'll pop these now. There's no other reason to. And uh, yeah, of course I'm going to miss the 77%. Why would I not miss it? Uh, you know, that would, no, it wouldn't allow me to get out. So, funny enough, I have to use the Cursed All once. If I went to three damage, I, uh, if I went to three stamina, I would have just, just for action. Again, saying what I'm saying out loud uh, for the, f uh, for the sake of the viewer. I also need to remember to get stamina before I run into Akamanto. Definitely before I run into Akamanto, because this is going to hurt. So, um, enough that I'm going to be low enough for Akamanto to insta- it's the kill me uh, before I even enter the fight. Oh my goodness, this is not guaranteed either. I guess I'm just gonna go for it. Listen, I missed those 77%. Give me this 85. Good. Now I have to be a bit more careful, in my opinion. But, uh, you know what? We'll witch just tree for stamina. And there's the brain damage. So, uh, barely can't see behind the hair, but I mean, I know I'm at like two or lower, so, hey. Uh, yeah, it. Really, it's really not great to get fetid fumes, you know, but at least I have bath. In this case, it's not as helpful because I need to survive the mystery first, but hey. um, Yeah, let's keep moving. I think I have a few more investigations left. You know, if I'm just going to use up a bunch, I'm, I might as well use up a bunch of doom. Whether or not I have fetid fumes, I need the stamina, so. uh, Yeah, we're just going to, we're going to rest a lot. So we're probably going to rest like five times uh, that I need that much to survive. And I think I can enter. I can probably rest one more time. Again, I'm going to get the Crestfallen Mask, um, but, you know. But to close out that topic on note, don't taking whatnot, again, usually I don't. Um, obviously, if I'm trying... Six Perception for a Katana. I'm going to do this instead, yeah. So, 
Um, I didn't want to take the stamina damage if I failed. It's too risky. I might have gotten the katana, but it's liter it was literally 50-50. So, yeah. Um, what do I get here? Do I- I remember that this is- yeah, this is not guaranteed. Oof, three strength. <laughs> it's because of three strength, man. Uh, 13 damage. I need to throw something. I can't even handcuffs. Well, I also need to hope for, uh... What do I hope for? Um... Trade for a reason? I think I'm trading for a reason. Yeah, I'm gonna trade for a reason. And, uh, then we'll take this. I should be able to two-turn him. It's just that I need stamina, so... Yeah, we'll take this damage for now. Yes, my reason is now lower, but for now, I'm going to take a bit more stamina. And then, yeah, this is not guaranteed. Oof. Uh, um, go for a 90%. Go for... Oh, we can curse doll. Let's curse doll, actually. Yeah, let's curse doll. I'm not... I. It's too spooky for me. Listen, I don't know... People who take 85, 95%, you know, I understand why you do. For me, though, it's not great. And then 75 and 65s, I don't know you how you can live with yourself. You monsters! Uh, I, I would make a joke about a certain thing here, but I'm not. I'm gonna withhold that. And, uh, yeah, this is... That's right, I'm losing reason at the end of every mystery, too, so... Uh, do I just die at the lighthouse here? I think I just die at the lighthouse here, but... Nothing else I can do about that. I mean, I'm, I'm just going to die. I can crestfallen mask rest at the lighthouse, but that's assuming I even make it there, so... With coma on top of that, oh, bu oh, buddy boy. Um, at least I'm not losing more uh, more reason. Yeah, I think I still am losing some though. There are still some bugs here and there, but what can I do, right? Uh, I'm probably yeah. As I wait for this, I might as well just do some item management while I'm here. Um, I have a lot of funds. Do I want to do anything with them? I, I think I am. So I'm gonna do this. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm still gonna do this. I need a pack of cigarettes. Is what I'm gonna tell myself. Um, do I have Takshis? I don't think I have Takshis on, right? I think I do. I don't, I don't remember. Why do I? I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> uh, yes, I could take notes down. Like, I would not advise someone not to, like, if if you're new to World 4, just just write down what sigils you have in the lighthouse so that you can reference it. I don't care if you do it on a, on notepad or, you know, on your um, command line. Oh my goodness. I was going to say command line Linux. I forgot what actually. They, they have a few options, but I think I just die here, so... Well, I gave it my best shot. Um, three strength is not great, but that's the character, that's the... that's what they chose for immersion. I was immersed enough to... well, <laughs> as I lamented, three strength meat cleaver, but hey. Oof. Uh, so let's move on. Uh, what do I have here? Uh, 11 into 6, so... What is that? Ath? Yeah, Ath. Fatalist character specific. Uh, stuff. So we're gonna equip this anyway, because they have it on. I guess this is my quote-unquote limitation. I can't put anything else on slot B. If I do, don't hold me to that, because uh, I'm doing what I can to survive. So <laughs> second encounter. I will try to leave it on, though. Second encounter, strength, light, takshisan, knowledge, and um, second mystery, maybe. Um, at, usually how I remember the lighthouse is just how much damage I'm taking. If I don't get damage, so be it, but in this case, I have strength, knowledge, and every non-stat check. That much I might not remember, but at least, you know, I'll... It'll be better than nothing. It'll be better than the previous run, so... Let's see what we get. Expel evil, and then we also have Threat of Fate. Oh, that's right, because we're on Ath. Um... Yeah, we'll sell the, uh, we'll sell the library notes now. I might as well. Oops, I left the house for some reason, just to just to kind of enjoy the breeze as I as this person has the apartment mask. Gender unknown, question mark? But, as we move on, uh, let us continue onward and uh, prepare a heist to nowhere as I get Fatalist into Ward immediately. So I don't even get a chance to get the hospital pass, but hey, uh, for Doom, so be it. Hey, thank goodness we have, uh, one, we have a weapon, and two, we got, um, Expel Evil. That said, our luck is still not great, so if we keep taking damage in these events, we might die, but hey. But yeah, just, if you have to take notes, just take notes. I don't care if you're doing, I don't even, I don't hold it against anyone, even if you don't tell the people who are watching you, whether you're a streamer or content creator, if you do it, just uh, don't feel bad about it, because there's a lot to this game, or any other game that, you know, requires, uh, remembering things. I just got something. Uh, so I was checking something really quickly. Can I, I? I can only sever twice, right? Okay, good. I lose two all for this, but 
I need something, so... <laughs> uh, away I go. So, yeah, we'll double sever again. This much I don't care about, but yeah, the moment you don't get two turns that it takes three... The moment it takes three turns for you to defeat that ghost encounter, that's a lot more doom, so... That said, I don't know why I increased my threat level here. Let's find out if it's at max. Not yet, but we're getting there. Um, and we'll move on. I think hospital might be the only... I mean, yes, there is a... There is a uh, general event. I don't know what I want to call them. Um, a non-location specific event that increases your threat level, but in terms of locations that actually just can increase your uh, threat level, sorry. Yeah, that's one of them. Uh, look, uh, the hospital is one of those locations. Yeah, we definitely can't take this. Funny, and, yeah. As it turns out, when you don't have handcuffs, uh, yeah, you can't you can't fight that one. I would also make another comment, but I'm going to withhold that comment because it's not actually not a fair comment to say in terms of balance. But anywho, uh, heal reason because I'm gonna be taking a lot of reason. And let's what's next? Co a lot of hospital investigations, but uh, we have two max threat level locations. I'm just gonna say mansion. And we'll move on. Um, if I get to the fourth character, just know in advance that I will be... Um, uh, it's my character because I just decided to kind of round it out if we're at four. If we don't reach the fourth character, so be it. I did also make a modification, so it's not the same as you would download in the community. Or specifically the Discord community, let's just say it. The Discord um, channels of that... It's all set up there. Um, we have there. There's a good community that's you know that set up good stuff there. So, uh, at least I can guarantee this. Oh, because eight power is that why? Yeah, probably that. I uh, two two stamina for a two turn encounter. Uh, even if they uh, the blood sucker drains HP, it's still two turns. So, yeah, a big numbers game, but. Um, the fun in the game comes from the events that can happen to you in a different order than you expect. And then also your RNG, but if you don't like RNG because you're, you like being skill-based, I mean, it, it, it's, it's, you have to deal with RNG. <laughs> uh, but that's also why I sometimes omit that from, um, what I define as people's fun. Because, um, usually in my experience, people don't think RNG is fun, so... And I mean, I I do agree. Like, if you if you play very very well and you end up dying to RNG, that's uh, if to an extreme, it's not great. But um, after a certain point, I mean, some RNG there is some you know skill in. I don't want to say skill exactly, but to try and explain it, um, if RNG doesn't go your way, there is kind of what is not splendor. Um, pr not pride either, but there is some, you know, something you could feel proud about by saying, hey, I played well enough that even if RNG tried to screw me up, I still survived. So, there's, aside from, you know, that's, that's assuming, like, near perfect or optimized play, um, without taking into account being able to predict the exact events you're going to run into, uh, we, you can still say, hey, the game threw me, like, a boomerang and hit me in the face, but I still survived. Um, you can still feel good about that. You can feel good about... Uh, yeah, playing well. And again, this is assuming non-perfect optimized play. Like, if you make a mistake here and there, there or if you uh, don't know something or don't remember something, in my case, don't remember something, but, you know, you, you're, you're getting where I'm going with this, right? Uh, you can feel good about, you know, making certain decisions here and there. And in World of Horror's case, or any game that happens to allow you to take... Um, to make multiple, like, change your build and or play with different builds... Uh, you can feel pride in saying, hey, I chose to play this way and I, and I survived. Well, it may not be the most consistent and I might not be the most happy with it because I'm like, girl, that never works for me. Uh, I can still see why, um, yeah, simple, even like more detailed or simple things, quote unquote, no, no, deep, that, though, that's optimis, opposite. What I mean by that is even if you play, you know, more risky, you have a choice. You can either play risky and go for more damage so that you can, you know, try to escape an encounter with more resources, or you can just take the uh, um, guaranteed more damage, but um, it's a more stable way. Or, you know, the way, the, um, the, oh, my goodness, I can't run from this encounter, by the way. Can I brace at least? I can. Uh, 95%. But, again, you have you have a choice in what you want to do. And then, But the examples I usually like to use are whether you like rolling, you know, something as small as the students at the school to see if you get, like, two points in strength or uh, stats in a certain... the stats that you want. Or, um, 
If you'd like to roll on spells either as Kyrie or you enable the library for whatever reason and you decide to roll three or four spells and you decide, hey, maybe I'm going to get spells. Again, you have different ways to play the game. Um, it's just that for me, I uh, I gravitate towards uh, buying a weapon from the hardware shop because, again, I don't like to rely on spells. Someone might use spells in a vacuum of runs like they succeed 80% of their runs because they just happen to get, like, you know, Ghostly Spear and Mind Drain for, like, 75% of the runs. Uh, and then the times they don't, they get, you know, maybe they get Memory Extract and or Book of Gore. You know, things like that. But uh, for me, those that, that strategy doesn't work out. But it's another way you could play the game, uh, which is how why it makes World of Horror more fun to play, in my opinion, than other games. So... And that's where, and that's where the not the skill, but I guess the RNG factor, as I forget to fill my empty bottle, um, comes in during um, in this game. Whereas in other games, you know, and I understand, and we understand it, you know, whether you're speed running, whether you're just trying to optimize, whether you're trying to work the numbers, um, there is a more optimized method of being consistent, of you know, doing the best you can do in certain encounters. You know, you there's no way to get away from that, but. Um, we're in botanist, by the way. Uh, can I one turn, uh, two turn this encounter, by the way? I should be able to. I can get close. Uh, I need to hit this, by the way. If I don't, I'm gonna handcuff this one. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna handcuff this encounter. Um, if I have coma, so be it. But, uh, yeah, in other games, oftentimes you're usually stuck with two or three, which isn't, at least it's not one guaranteed method to go through a game, I guess. But, um... It's also not the most, like, in a world of 40, maybe there's, like, a few as well, so it's not really that much more. But you have different ways to play. And again, it's, yeah, you know, not everyone is just picking Ico and playing their whole runs. Some people might be, but, uh, again, at a, after a certain point, that's why I like to include my subjective, uh, uh, or say that I have a subjective view in the game in terms of I look at a vacuum of uh, quick play runs. I'm going to do reason here, by the way. Uh, rather than, you know, just going for a Harbinger run where you can set anything you want. Because if I can set anything I want, I would either pick Aiko or Toshiaki in, for me anyway. I would pick um, Toshiaki and uh, or Aiko, play on Harbinger with World of Horror backstory on Ath. That's that's literally what I do and I'd probably, I'd pro my win rate would probably shoot up by, you know, 50%. But because I'm the way I am um, and I play with different characters, not saying that that's... Um, not saying that that's a point of, uh, pride, that's just what I do. Um, yeah. <laughs> My win rate is a lot lower because I lament the fact that I have to play a certain way. Um, and not, you know, find success. Uh, what do I get here? Three turns, six doom. Oh my goodness, that's really bad. Um, if I do this, though, it's not that much better. So I do get four doom per turn. Um... Eight, uh, when I do 8 HP, 5, 5 Doom, take 5 Doom in this encounter. I mean, I run for 5 Doom, so you know what? I might as well just do this. Uh, again, though, if I wanted to play more risky as I proceed to get a Swollen Joint, because the um, well, now I can't run, but haste the aid. Um, yeah, we'll move on. So let's just keep bracing. So f about, I might want to take a risk this turn. Again, every percent of Doom you save can be a way you survive, so... 95%. Watch me miss this, by the way. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, to reiterate, for those who are new, newer, newer to this channel and have never heard me say it, I will never say my luck is the absolute worst, but it is still, on average, bad, so... Again, someone else might be just be playing with spells, they might just be playing with just attacks every turn, they might be playing with no weapons, but me... That's not happening on this channel, so... So we're at 74-ish uh, percent Doom on our going into our last mystery. Um, that's actually not as high as it could be. Usually I'm, ex I'm expecting to be at 78. 80% is a bit much to say now that I say it, but... Um, well, 71%, but... Regardless, 70% is uh, still a bit... I'm at least sailing smoothly is what I want to say. Unfortunately, we have to let Kana die here, as great as mitigation against Takshi-san uh, might be. Yeah, Takshi-san. Um, not the best, so... Uh, that said, I am going to 
So for 6% doom, I grab a pack of cigarettes. Do I want to grab a pack of cigarettes? I do have flesh regrowth as well. I also have expel evil. Yeah, you know what? Let's do some trading here. So we'll do that into that. That way I can go into the police station, trade a bunch of uh, funds. I'm going to even do more. I'm just going to... I'm not going to care about reaching level 4. If I do, it's great. If not, so be it. We'll do one investigation. Hope we don't run into an encounter. And then smoke these cigarettes. Well, it's a good thing I spent the doom there, but... Let's, we might as well visit the monument, right? One fund? Okay, well. I mean, let's move on then. So, 12 cigarettes that might last me till Takshik's on. I want to say, I did run into an encounter immediately afterward. Unfortunately, I don't one tap her, or two tap her. But, um, I think I can do something close, yeah. So, uh, no, we're not going to do that because that's a bit quote unquote cheating in my opinion. I'm not going to blame anyone else for doing it, but I will miss 90%. So, I mean. Who, who's saying? Who's Who who dares say that uh, <laughs> that 90% isn't 50-50? Um, yeah, we might as well just do this now. I don't know why I took that extra damage. Actually, I know why, because this is not guaranteed. So I can do this, however. So let's do this and get out. Uh, but what I want is to finish this mystery as soon as possible, so I can just rest at the lighthouse. Um, I have 8 strength, so really I'm only taking... Um, Three stamina, which means I should have more than enough resources to survive. That said, I should just, uh, you know what, let's actually visit the tree as well. Traumatized, so be it. I do have flesh regrowth, but I don't want to rely too much on spells. I also have Thread of Fate and Mind Drain. Uh, so, I don't think this, yeah. Well, it may cost a little bit of Doom, but it's not the most. Uh, so let's keep casting that. I shouldn't be losing more than that, though. Still, though, I'm willing to you. well, yeah, I'm willing to, let's roll on this. Three Doom for this. Let's find out. I got close. If I used Mind Drain again, I would have gotten out, but let's, let's hold off on Reason, just in case I run into something really bad, but, which, well, keep in mind, without Kana, that would have been doing four Doom, but during Eels, you have uh, Kana for that investigation, thankfully, so, yeah, and then we, uh, we pretty much just run away. So, do we survive or not? Let's find out. Uh, we don't have bats, so we immediately go in and, uh, yeah, what we see is what we get. So second encounter, which I completely forgot. Uh, do I have the sixth floor as well? I do. Uh, I don't remember. I took ward into something. Oh, coma, coma. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, nine doom, 14% doom. So I can, I, well, I could rest once if I wanted to. I shouldn't need to though, because I'm only losing, uh, Three stamina and three reasons, so away I go. Unfortunately, I think Takashi san let's find out actually. I don't remember. Uh, ward, ward, ward. So I want to say I ran to something before the boss, so I'm just going to say it's, yeah. I'm just, I'm trying to use, I use some logic there to figure that out. I didn't remember at all. I know I took ward first though. Uh, but anywho, I should level up here. I should have leveled up here. Now we're stuck in Takashi san but uh, still shouldn't matter too much. In fact, I can mind drain uh, Takshis on a bunch here, so we'll go down to four just in case anything really strange happens. But uh, essentially, that's the damage I would have taken. Um, I should be able to guarantee an out, right? I'll even throw the baseball bat just to be sure. But hey, but uh, coma should be my second mystery, so I shouldn't need to worry there. We're now under nicotine withdrawal, but there are no more encounters, so it's fine. Yeah, and we do survive. So. Without further ado, I think I will make a cut, because I have to take care of something, but I'll be back with the two characters in the same video, so I'll see you then. Hey, gotta make a cut. But as I get back into it after that, uh, let's see where we left off, and I will try to take notes and figure out what else I can do, because if I can get everything- yeah, okay, just making sure. We're also gonna do Hunted, hunted by the Cult here, oh my goodness, Hunted by the Cult, if I can. And uh, we'll move on. Actually, I need to see what god I'm at. So five, it don't do. So I don't know where exactly I'm gonna be, make, be making cuts here and there, but I know I will. Um, I would play a certain way, but I think I'm just instead going to uh, do what I can to survive on Harbinger. Second mystery, charisma, dexterity, strength, light, knowledge. Every single stat check, uh, light and second mystery for sure though. Um, since we start off with weapons, not the best, but they're okay for now, uh, maybe, we're gonna find out. Um, 
I mean, yes, if I grab a spell or something, you, you're going to see what happens. Otherwise, Kyoko will help out. Uh, definitely, the extra damage on a steak knife will definitely help out more than the hunting rifle. Um, which, yeah, it does 32 damage when shot. That's something I have to remember because that's actually very good. If and when I get bullets, uh, <laughs> there aren't very many enemies. Uh, there aren't very many enemies that start with uh, or that go up to 33 HP or more. There are some, but um, they're usually far and few between. And even if there are some, um, they can be dealt with um, quite easily in their own ways. So, arms, coma, flood, festival, and sailors. Well. <sighs> I want to do Arms and Flood. I guess we'll do Coma now, so that I can try to get funds here and there. Um, yes, while we're not going to... Oh, I shouldn't have sold that. Well, <laughs> while I won't be getting... Uh, yeah, I won't be getting a weapon, so to say. I think I want to do 5 for bullets? And the doom, the doom we spend here is pretty much going to be things. Of course, if we don't get ammo at all, um, just die, I guess. And uh, we'll, we'll try one more time, just in case. Yeah, so... We need these three this three ammunition. It will definitely help out. Um, I could instead sell the steak knife, the steak knife, but I don't think I want to. So we're going to monument to trade some things. And if we get out of funds, I guess we'll trade stamina or reason, uh, because 24 24% 24 doom is what we're gonna be working with. So that's a bit high. Uh, I wouldn't like to be here, but I decided to get ammo, and um, the next time I play, I guess, you'll know why I'm not getting ammo. So, uh, that said, the high stats do help out. It's just uh, the weapons that I'm given aren't the best. I would like to make better use of them, but uh, I don't think I really can. Actually, let me see. So, Seaside or Police, or, uh, sorry, not Police, um, the Hospital. I'd rather do Hospital. Uh, now we'll keep going. Yeah, so 40% doom already. Let's hope. Uh, or we could make use of this, which I will. So I'll be back in a moment. Yeah, so with this ammunition, maybe maybe I shouldn't have uh, <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have spent so much doom. Again, I didn't I didn't know I was going to be running to the doll nurse. That's to me it's not even 50-50. I would say like 33%, but hey. Also I have to keep in mind that I would have five strength if it wasn't weren't for Iwa, so. Again, this Doom has to pay itself off uh, in encounters and sometimes events, depending. Um, otherwise, I have to avoid Doom like the Plague and hope that my Reason and Stamina stay moderately healthy. Um, whether that actually happens, though, well, we'll see. No bath, so... Hey. Uh, let's see, what do we have? I want to take Arms or Flood, right? Yeah, so I guess we'll take Flood now. Um, we are going to be able to save a bit of Doom. It's just... Everything else that I'm not, uh, that I'm kind of afraid of. But for now, being able to do 10 damage a turn is pretty good. Uh, 12 damage with the help of bonus damage, but really just 10. Um, against other encounters, though, we'll see. What am I on? At though 2, yeah, that's why I was doing so much. So, yeah. Uh, let's go to the school, and then we'll look for the Theologist and leave. Because with though 2 burning up this mystery, uh, it will not be great. So... Yeah, let's go into the forest and find this guy ASAP. We might die to reason. Uh, yeah, so le let's take reason damage there. We'll rest. I should be able to rest twice, but I'm only going to rest once. Uh, just looking at my stamp. Yeah, so now we can rest again. And we can pretty much rest for the rest of the mystery. So away I go. Um, uh, so yeah, I didn't really think about it. But now that I think about it, because I have Flood, I can spend a little bit more Doom. Not much. I would I would still like to not be at 39% right now. 40% um, is usually my breast threshold, but if I could help it, I would usually choose not to. So, let's do this. While it will be healing, the boss will be healing HP. Um, I can at least, this is still effective damage I deal on the boss. And then we have, uh, yeah, unfortunately we take a lot of damage here, so... We're gonna brace, um, and we do five damage a turn. But it's better than it's better than three damage at possibly fifteen. Um, but it's not guaranteed, so hence why we are doing this method of attacking. Um, and pretty much near the end here, I'm gonna get. I, I'm going to put myself low on reason, but I'll trade off uh, about four, maybe six stamina for uh, for more, basically. So yeah, with that, uh, I'm gonna trade. I'm gonna do this three times. And then we'll do a prep strong and we can get out. So, 
That said, maybe I should have equipped the hunting rifle instead, but I needed to get rid of the ammunition, the broken bottles and branches I had in my inventory because otherwise uh, I, I would not have... <laughs> I, I would not have the space to... Uh, and I would rather use the 12 damage there than get a shot off. That said, though, um, I will still pick this stuff up. Actually, I just need to use this, right? I don't know why I was sitting on things there, but... I was, and that wasn't good. We lost bath, but... Uh, hopefully, as we go into arms, it's not going to be as painful. Granted, I do need stamina for this mystery, but it's not the worst thing. I probably should have visited the police station, or anything else, really. Um, I can get close to one-shot. Can I one-shot? I can one-shot him. Okay, good. Um, just making sure that there's no weird graphical bug, but it works out. Uh, let's spend two Doom for one fun. Otherwise, out of funds is not going to be nice. We get two more funds there, but I didn't know I was going to run into that vent. For all I know, that could have been out of funds when I had zero funds. Yeah, yep, yeah, and into into this... Oh my goodness, my let me clear my throat as I throw this broken bottle. Yeah, I had a cough really quickly. Um, Do I want to just take for a reason? No, I don't. Um, I can get this off. I actually might be able to get something better. Nope, uh, kind of. If I hit this, I can get out next turn. So let's go for it. Um, but yeah, but that's the kind of RNG I'm usually banking on. Anything else, it gets a bit scary for me. But we're not going to be running into any encounters anytime soon. Uh, we don't have fetid fumes, right? So I could rest if I chose to. Um, and let's grab more. We can't handcuff anything else here. Um, I don't think there's even a human enemy here. So right before... The end of this mystery will equip the hunting rifle, and we will see what we can do. Well, nice luck check, by the way, but if I die to reason, I guess so be it. That's me dying to reason. Uh, we'll take that in the face. Yeah, let's rest again. <laughs> let's rest again, even, because uh, I don't feel confident with that much. If I have to live off the rest of this run with 10 stamina and 4 reason, I would not be willing to do so. Um, and yeah, let's switch here, and then we can keep the steak knife. I will instead take out another branch, and let's see if we're on timeline B. We are not, so... We can save this ammunition or for literally anything else. Uh, otherwise, yeah, with this ammo stash, I might just want to continue firing off rounds. Um, let's heal reason. I don't think I need anything else. Just checking to see. I think I have knowledge, right? Yeah, so we're just gonna take three stamina. We're just gonna take three stamina damage regardless if I can speak correctly. And we're also going to take three uh, reason damage. Did I say reason? I'm going to take three stamina and three reason damage. Uh, because I'm going to fail the light check and the knowledge check. Let's visit the festival now. Uh, one doom for one stamina, one reason. And then we visit the festival. If we get someone cool, cool. If we don't, we're skipping. Um, because, yeah, we don't spend any doom here. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we'll take Yoichi with us. We'll, we don't have, we shouldn't have uh, Paranoia now, so I'm just going to let him go immediately so that I can um, get cigarettes on my last mystery. So yeah. Which should last me until the end of the run. We're going to keep the hunting rifle on. Well, we don't have access to storage anyway, but the point is that I should have enough ammunition for the rest of this run. Uh, if we can not fire off around, that'd be great, but we will, so... Yeah, with the, knowing that the, what the hunting rifle can do, um, yeah, it, it one of the only firearms to be useful aside from the old shotgun, but that's a Moriko thing or a custom character, or custom character thing, depending. Um, and with cigarettes, I should definitely be able to continue firing off rounds uh, because the thing about ringing ears is it, is it can result in you not being able to guarantee a shot, which isn't the worst thing if you if you're willing to roll on I don't know however much accuracy you have, but I usually like to prep shoot. Or prep anything, really. So, uh, if we run to the priest here, we are going to skip, but we're on timeline A, so it's fine. So yeah, for the last mystery, we might not even need cigarettes, but I'm going to get them anyway. Um, just to do so. So, yeah, let's... Into sailors we go, and then, yeah, we wanted to save at least some of these, because uh, we need to throw things away. Um, before we're on time, it, just to prevent any Timeline B shenanigans. But we are going to grab cigarettes. We're going to wait a while. Um, I can fire off a shot because I don't remember when Takshi-san is coming. But if we're going to keep the... No, nah, no, nah, 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 we're going to do, do this. So, oh my goodness. My muttering... Uh, we're going to do this. And uh, store the cigarettes and take out everything else. 
And the cult hunt, uh, my my own cult members are on our trail. Well, you never know. Maybe these two decided to break away. Uh, let the police handle it for a reason. I could rest still, right? Yeah. We got price hike, but I accounted for that. And we can actually rest even more. I'm going to rest more. Um, I feel like I can. Even assuming we're going to take 13% more doom in the lighthouse, we should be able to. Uh, we have the Karakas. No, that's not the best. So... By the way, keeping in mind that the person who made this character, uh, these custom characters, I guess, plural is correct here, um, they did have to basically make two masks, so, uh, yeah. Anywho. Oh, I also forgot, if, if, it was, if it was a ghost encounter, it would have been a lot worse, but it's not, so thankfully, fire. Um, yeah, now we smoke the cigarettes. And we will move on with life. Um, we don't need anything else. We should just be able to hold on to things. If you run into a... Oh, we are on Seaside, by the way, but I don't really care. Um, if we ran into a human enemy, sure, it might have been bad. Actually, now I want to sell the mask, so let's do that really quickly. Um, and nope, not black hair. The I'm probably just the snake knife, all things considered, but let's wait on that. Um, nothing really here, so let's just take charisma. Um, yeah, it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna heal stamina just to heal stamina. And away we go. But yeah, no, nothing. The only, I don't know, is there a non-boss enemy that has more than, that can have more than 34 HP? I don't think so, right? So, uh, yeah, away we go. And, uh, yeah, we should survive no matter what. If something really, really strange happens, I, I mean, I guess I die, but I shouldn't die. Um, even failing both or all of my doom checks and assuming that Takashi, well, we don't have Takashi san, never mind. We have every single stat check, but we should be fine no matter what. So we're going to do this and uh, move up. So yeah, without further ado, I think this, yeah, I'm not going to move on to the fourth character. So you know what? Um, I am going to uh, call this the end of the video, so I will might as well do it now. There's not really much else to do as I ascend this lighthouse. I'd like to thank you for watching, and, uh, well, yeah, if you have anything else to say, you know what to do. If you want to support me, you know what to do as well. If you don't know what to do, I guess I'll say it in another video, but I just don't want to take up more of your time. So without further ado, uh, we've reached the end of this lighthouse, the end of this video, and I'll see you later. Bye!